I went from condos to pop's house. On calls, now bus routes. And the one person who had the key to my heart took it and checked out. Yeah, I mean, that's how the environment, you know, when you a kid growing up, you know, would affect you a little bit, you know, because, um, you know, even though I grew up in that area, you know, my mom, you know, she trying to keep me out of the schools and stuff around there, but not knowing, sending me to school over there in Inglewood, I'm around Inglewood family now. So no we got red P uniforms, but before I go back on the other side, she like, take off them uniforms. <laughs> you feel me? Like, you know you what kinda, I'm saying? You kind of know, mama. Yeah, that's what yeah, I'm saying. she know what's so up. It's like, that's what I'm saying, but they don't know that it'd be hard on us. Yeah, yeah. You feel me? Like, she's smiling and giggling, like, take that off, boy. But when they see me in these school pictures, and all this other stuff, you feel me? I gotta go back and talk to them. What's up, Max. man? Why you over there with them? What's going? Tell us what they got going on. You like, man? I'm just going to school. Yeah. So it's always, you know, what I'm saying, moms and pops don't be knowing how deep it be, unless they gang bang. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? If they a regular family, they don't know what's going on in these streets. Yeah, yeah. That's facts. That's facts. So um, moving along a little bit, uh, you actually experienced, you know, you know, growing up over there as a as a as a kid and teenager. Yeah. Um, when they was filming um the movie Training Day. Yeah. So yeah. you was kind of a part of it and everything like that. Yeah, uh, uh, can you talk about that a little bit? No, I wasn't really involved because you had to be like twenty one and shit. But I'm okay. tatted up. You feel me? So when they get to acting like we need some uh some people to be in the video. Yeah. That's tatted. You know, I'm like, shit, I know I'm finna be in this. You feel me? I'm tatted up already young. You feel me? I've been blasted. Yeah. So uh, they come with the with the paperwork and shit. Like, uh, you got to be 21 and over. So I'm mad as a motherfucker. I'm like, man, 21 and over. You know, I didn't woke my mama up and shit. Like, mama, they finna shoot this movie over with Denzel. We already seen Denzel. He didn't came out, talked to the people. You feel wow. me? Yeah, like, it's live. You feel me? He's shooting dice with us and shit. What? Yeah, so... uh. The homie's like, man, y'all finna be in the video and, and uh, he finna have y'all play the part and shit. We like, what? So I break home, come back, you know, ready and shit. They like, nah, 21 and over. Damn. I'm like, fuck. So they grabbed a homie JT, you feel me, and eight ball, couple of other homies, you feel me, that was uh, white boy John, them grabbed all them and put them in it, you feel me? I'm like, mad as fuck. Like, so I'm coming every day, like, blasting my music and shit. Like, man, I need to be in this, you feel me? Yeah, yeah. So, like, you know, we in the video, but we like we ended at the end of the credits and shit. Okay. You feel me? Being nosy, looking in the camera and shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That shit, cause we was real little. Yeah. You feel me? But the homies got in. That shit was cool. Denzel came through. You feel me? They had the little black trucks and some of the homies went and seen Dr. Dre and shit at the trailer. Oh. Yeah, that shit was real cool. Yeah, yeah. Hey, that that's the beauty though. No matter where you grow up in L.A., that's the beauty about being in L.A. Because Hollywood is right here. So you never know what you're gonna be a part of. Oh, yeah, for sure. Growing up, you know, around here and everything like that, you know. So, man, that's that's crazy, man. That's what's up, man. Um, did did they also was you also over there when they filmed um Imperial Dreams? Yeah, I was. I was. I'm in that. Oh, you in that? I'm in every movie that they filmed oh, over there. Shit. You feel me? Yeah, I'm a part of all that. I'm I'm right there when they came uh when they uh came and uh trying to drop the kid off. Yeah. And we throwing the trash. That's me throwing the trash. Like, get the fuck oh, up out of wow. here. Yeah, that's me right there. You yeah, feel me? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's crazy. That's what's up. So you got to, like, meet DeAndre Bonds and yeah. John Boyega and yeah, everything. Yeah, that's yeah, dope. Yeah. That's dope. Yeah, because the story based on one of my homies, you feel me? Okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, so he came and hanged out, you feel me? Give a shout out to my boy, uh, uh, PJ Bam and, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, you feel me? Okay. Yeah, that was a big part of that, you feel me? Did a real power move. And uh, it's crazy because uh, now I see him on Star Wars and shit. Wow. Yeah. Boyega. Oh, Boyega. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. See him on Star Wars. And, yeah. You know, he doing his thing. That's what's up, man. But you got to come back to the ghetto, man. You feel me? We got you on first. Yeah. You feel me? You got to come back, man. Reach out. You feel me? Yeah, yeah. Tap in. I mean, that's facts. You got to show love, man, where it started. You know yeah. what I'm saying? You know, because after that movie, he, psh, come he was on, gone. Come on, man. You skyrocket, man. Yeah, after yeah. that, you feel me? Yeah, real yeah. Real talk. Did 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 being a, a part of that and seeing you know you know those movies and everything like that get you in a mentality to where you wanted to like be more a part of something like that you know uh, like at, like acting and, and uh, it's crazy because uh, my boy uh, Marcus Paul they played Martin okay he already had me doing movies wow yeah I did a movie called Sister Cole with uh, Amber Rose what yeah and Eve and Eva yes yeah, so it's it's on uh on a uh, all the platforms and shit, Netflix and all that. Yeah, like, it's crazy because I've always been doing, like, little stuff, you know what I'm saying? We're, 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 like, what I'm saying, you got to have a real crowd around you 
and they see the potential in you, you feel me, and be like, man, check this out, man, you need to do this and do that. So yeah, I was kind of like already acting, you feel me, doing my little thing, and uh, yeah, it was perfect opportunity, but when I started telling them what I was doing, and you know what I'm saying, they looking at uh, my BMI and my ass cap, and they like, oh, you already been? I'm like, yeah, you know what I'm saying, <laughs> I've been kind of putting my foot already in, through the door already. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's what's up, man, you know, just, just being, you know, in the city and, and, and a part of that, you know, look at where, you know, it took you. You know, you yeah. got your name, you know, name up in there where people could recognize you from those films and everything. Yeah, you know, real so talk. that's dope. I had to show 